70. So uh, not quite as cool during the overnight and that's a little subtle sign that the humidity is starting to creep back in tropics. We've got depression number 12. This one does not look like it will reach tropical storm status, so it won't get a name. We've also got this tropical wave, it's Invest 91 L. It's now in the southeastern Caribbean. It's very close to Venezuela and South America. Uh, so as it continues to the west, it's going to have some land interaction. It's going to have a hard time trying to develop as long as it stays close uh, to land there. But as it gets into the central and western Caribbean, a much more favorable environment for developing. Again, the weather service, the hurricane center is giving it a high probability and you see the congruency in the forecast modeling through Tuesday of next week. So we're not expecting this to turn to the north thanks to this area of high pressure in the Gulf of Mexico that will suppress a northward turn. If anything changes, we'll adjust. But at this point, uh, this is just something to watch and not worry about for Texas. You see the absence of wind shear there in the central part of the Caribbean Sea tonight, mainly 